for me, Real Python is a chance to teach coding to myself. That was a huge gift. It was a great supporter this semester when I actually had to code difficult numerical programs by myself for the first time. And it will continue to be a great help when improving, when learning this summer and I think also in the semesters to come. My name is Leona Rodenkirchen. I'm from Germany. I study theoretical physics there in Aachen and I have done mostly analytical work in my bachelor's but now in my master's I was facing more and more the need to do computational work and also I wanted to because I don't want to rely on others to do my coding. In my bachelor's we did do some coding. We basically only needed coding in Python to analyze data and at this point, I would just Google a bunch of things, I would use Stack Overflow or W3 School, but I really didn't understand a lot of things. So when I would get errors, I didn't understand what was happening. And I really didn't know how to tweak things in the way I wanted them to without having to Google again. Uh, so I never really learned it from the bottom up. And that was really frustrating. And for a, long, for a long time, I resented coding a lot. I didn't want to do it. I thought it was just stupid handiwork that's, that other people should do for me because I just dreaded it. But I like, I feel like it's like with a lot of things, it's very similar when you don't understand it and you just have to use someone else's results. It's super frustrating. But when you get the idea and get to build and create in, on your own, it becomes challenging, but interesting too. It's like, it's, it's, it's more of a process and more of a learning experience. There are a bunch of features, so you can do courses, video courses. They can, they have also tutorials. They have a tutorial, a fitting tutorial with the with the video course. I feel like the range of, of, of written tutorials is very broad and very detailed, really well done by experts. My most favorite part and what makes to me um, Real Python very special is this whole learning path idea where they put um, different video tutorials and quizzes and uh, video courses together um, and structure it so someone interested in that specific area, topic or field can start from the bottom up and learn and improve and practice um, over the span of maybe weeks, depending on how quickly you want to you wanna push through that. This semester I took a course that's called computational physics. And one of the most important tools that we learned to use in this course is NumPy, which is a library in, in, in Python. And I had used NumPy before, but NumPy is a huge library. It has so many amazing and very, very useful features. And one of the most important features in NumPy that uh, my professor regularly mentioned was broadcasting. Now I had no idea what broadcasting was. So that was definitely a thing that was a huge aha moment for me when I went to um, to use real Python. They were simply put their other their rules about broadcasting, and I really didn't understand those rules. But um, understanding them, reading through this in in Python, enabled me to make my code way more efficient. Definitely more confidence when approaching this big project of, well, somewhat becoming a coder, because for, before really, as I said, was more of an analytical theorist, which is not something that really exists anymore. And I had to come to terms with the fact that I need to learn how to code to be someone worthwhile as a physicist, really. <laughs> but also then I found out because it's something that I want to do. And with real Python, I enjoy doing it. So it's not, not just like the chore, not a thing that's the job market needs me to provide, but something that I feel like I can grow from, I can learn, and I can do that with Real Python really well. To students like me, or people who don't really know how to learn to code, but they really do want to learn, uh, I would really recommend this tool. I mean, it is an investment, especially if you don't earn much yet at all, like us, like students. Um, uh, but I would still very, very much recommend to people who want to learn how to code 
um, because it's definitely, in my opinion, worth the money. It's not too much and it's way less than you would pay to go to school. And it's very well designed so that you can choose how to approach things yourself.